Hello Sagittarius, this is your July 2018 reading. Taken uh, to consideration, this may not resonate with all Sagittarius people, but I'm hoping that it'll reach many of you. Sagittarius, July 2018. Sagittarius, July 2018. Sagittarius, July 2018. Did shuffle these prior, wanted to meditate on them, get them out, hopefully real soon. I wanted to upload these before July. Beginning energy, the Empress, something is not uh, growing or, or the way you want to. Uh, it's also known, for, it's basically known for fruition, growth, expansion. With some of these, it's a pregnancy. Very few of you, though. With others, it's just about growth in your life in general. It's in reverse, so you feel like there is no growth. You got the Ten of uh, Pentacles in reverse. Okay, I love to do with uh, finances. I've been getting this for a lot, a lot of the other uh, zodiac signs. Uh, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. It could be that money's tight. Or maybe it didn't come in the way you wanted it to. Or maybe you're trying to figure out how to get wealth and you just can't figure it out. Uh, let's see what's crossing it. Who's crossing the Ten of Pentacles? Five of uh, Wands. Strife. It's crossing the Ten of Pentacles. And you got, uh, so it has to do, it may cause arguments. Maybe there was an argument Maybe competition. Maybe there's too much competition and there's not a lot to go around. You know, money, opportunities for you. What's your goal? What is Sagittarius' goal? Princess of Wands. This could be your energy. Maybe you're trying to get your own power back. Princess of Wands is in the upright. She knows what she wants. She knows what she needs. And she's got the passion and the willpower to accomplish, to accomplish what she wants. So her goal is to put on that willpower, you know, and, and take on that power. The Princess of Wands could be another fire sign, too, but I'm thinking it's you. Foundation for Sagittarius, July 2018. Foundation. Feeling a little sorrowful, five of cups, feeling, I don't know, sad maybe because you, you not, you're not seeing the positives, you're just seeing the negatives, things that are, are that are disrupted. You're not seeing the, you're seeing three spilt cups in, in the five of cups. It's like five cups, three are spilt. You only see the three cups. You're not seeing the two full cups behind you. You're not feeling, you're not seeing the opportunities. You feel like you're missing out. You're just seeing that loss that you had, maybe due to competition, but there's something you're not seeing. So turn around and look around you. Look at all your options because you may have missed something. In the past for Sagittarius. What's in the past for Sagittarius? Oops, something that popped out. Queen of Wands in the reverse. Now this could be your energy again, but it also could be Aries or Leo. When it's in the reverse, this person is just just doesn't have it together right now. They just don't feel 100%, a little out of sorts, maybe even a little short-tempered. Queen of Wands. I'll, I'm going to clarify that in a minute. Let me, let me go to the near future. Then I'm going to lay out four more, and I'll get to them after I clarify all these. But I want to get to the near future. Near future for Sagittarius. Near future for Sagittarius. Getting this is a Prince of Wands. Now we're getting this a lot of fire energy. Now there's either, like I said, somebody else or it could be your energy. So the next few days or the next few weeks, you're going to be still feeling a little out of sorts. I'm going to clarify these. But let me do the last four here. I want to see what's going on because we're getting nothing but people court cards. And I want to know what's going on. First, I want to find out what the wealth is all about that's in reverse with the Five of Wands. Why is it there? Why is that there? For Sagittarius. Could have a lot to do with the King of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles is, he's showing up in some of the other spreads also. Uh, 
could be an earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, but it don't have to be. It could be someone who's an authority, someone who's stable, someone who controls the money situation. And maybe they just haven't, maybe you're trying to, to deal with this King of Pentacles. Maybe they're just not, you know, trying to, to work with you right now. Maybe they're also your competition. Princess of Wands, why are you the goal for Sagittarius? Why are you the goal for Sagittarius? Five, five of Swords. Five of Swords is a fighting energy. So you could be, if this is your energy with the uh, Princess of Wands, you could just, your goal is to fight for what you want. If it's not your energy, and it's another type of fire type energy, maybe you're wanting to fight with this other fire sign. It could be. You are having some sorrow here. You got the Five of Cups. You got disappointment. You're looking at the Three of Cups, like I said, that's built, not the Two of Cups behind you. Let's find out what's going on. Five of Cups, why are you there for Sagittarius as the foundation? Five of Cups again in reverse. You're just not seeing those two cups. You gotta you gotta see those two cups are there. Look at look for them because you can't come out of it. It's, it's showing me that you have the five of cups in the upright. With the reverse, you can turn that around. So look for those two cups and and leave it in the comments if there's something you might have missed that you overlooked. Okay, Queen of Wands in the past. Why is the Queen of Wands there? Why is the Queen of Wands in the past? reversed. Queen of Swords. I've got a lot of court cards. You're dealing with a lot of people. I want another card for the Queen of Wands. Queen of Swords is just like an air sign in the upright. Could be Aquarius, could be Gemini, could be Libra. They're attached to this Queen of Wands though. Hermit, keeping to themselves. Maybe you're just you and another person keeping to yourselves, or maybe you're thinking about this person, contemplating what to do. Prince of Wands, near future, in reverse. So this could be your energy. You're still feeling out of it the first couple of days, first few weeks of July. This is the near future. You got the distant future over here. We'll get to that in a minute. Prince of Wands, in reverse. Why are you there? For Sagittarius. It's like there's no give and take. You don't want to give and take with anybody. It's like you're frustrated. One more. That is the Six of Pentacles of give and take. You have the capability of doing it, but it's like you're a little put out. Ace of Swords. It's like you're just not wanting to deal with people. The outcome or the possible possible future outcome and the advice, or the advice card. And the advice card here, it's like a judgment, a sound judgment has would not be made. You're not gonna make it's it's like don't make any rash judgments or decisions or you know, because yeah, there's a tower. I saw that before I'm trying to come out. It's a possible tower situation. You're gonna hear something or something's gonna happen that may leave you feeling changed or disrupted or shocked. So it's saying here, leave your calendar open your life a little open because you may have to stop what you're doing and deal with something now that's the advice and the possible uh outcome is a decision won't be made and it'll shock you about something let's find out maybe i can get one more card on that decision decisions decisions what's going on here why is the tower oops Moving forward quickly, erratically. Something's coming quickly that may shock you. Or it's saying here, I'm feeling, leave your calendar open. Leave your, uh, don't make any, any permanent plans just yet because you may have to stop whatever you're doing and, and deal with the situation. I want to find out more what it is. Hold on. Now that this is coming your way, this person, another person, you may hear about a night of disc. And you get the four swords with the knight of disc in the upright it could be an earth sign it could be a uh, taurus capricorn virgo it could be something like that again but this is a slower type energy and there and the four swords is attached to this slow energy you may hear of someone maybe not feeling well 
maybe even someone passing on. Could be someone older. Or someone retiring. It could be so many different things. But you're hearing about this upright person, the stable person. Maybe they're just saying, I'm taking a break. I'm no longer doing this. I need one more card for the knighted disc. Could be someone from your past that you cared about. Maybe someone from the distant past, as a knighted disc is usually a slow energy or a far away energy sometimes. But you're hoping and fearing, or is the Three of Pentacles. You're hoping, you're fearing, I think, something won't work out with the Three of Pentacles. And you're kind of hanging around for some reason. Or you're not want, or should I say not want to hang around or just wait around for something to work out. It's like something's going way too slow. I think it's more about finances and outside family members and stuff. Or someone from the past. So you got the Five of Pentacles. You're going to worry. Oh, Sagittarius, I wish this was a better uh, reading, but i got to give them out the way that the universe gives me. It must be an important message for a few of you. Five of Pentacles. It's in the upright. Someone feeling abandoned, worried, and not know what's going on, not knowing what to do. But it's a temporary energy. I'm thinking it could do with finances. A distant family member, maybe. An old old person from the past, maybe. I don't know. I'm thinking it's someone to do with even possibly work for some of you. Five of uh, Pentacles. Why, why are you there as the outcome? Why are you there as the outcome? Queen of Cups. Could have to do with Queen of Cups energy. I got a lot of court cards here. So I'm trying to make sense of why all these people are here. To me, a lot of times it is individuals. So there's going to be a lot of people around. Finances may be a little tight. They are for a few people. You're feeling like you have no options left. You don't know what to do. You're sorrowful. You're disappointed. You're not seeing something that could help you. So look around. You may miss an opportunity. You're not seeing something. I feel on that strongly. You're not seeing something. And it causes you worry in, in the tower situation. So look for the help. Look for those two of cups. One more card for the uh, five of pentacles. We'll move on. Strength. You will regain strength. Or you may be helping someone else regain some strength. This queen of cups who is in reverse because someone is being abandoned. I'm thinking you're going to be helping some people out. But you're going to feel stretched. You are going to feel stretched. You got the devil in the upright as the overall as overall ending energy. So I'm feeling chained and tied down to a situation that's very, very difficult to get out of. So you're going to hear about something. And you may have to help some people out. There's, I see some sorrow. I see some a tower situation. I see worry. But I also know that the Two of Cups that's behind you is there. you got to look for it. And please, please listen to that. I know a lot of you probably won't listen to me on that. But look around. And hopefully this will work out. Leave it in the comments. If something did occur, maybe there's a loss of some sort. And I don't think it's necessarily with you real personally, but you may have to deal with it. It could be someone else that will leave, will kind of shock you when you when it comes to you. So that is your reading, Sagittarius. I wish I'd give you another one, but I gotta put what's out there. And apparently this is meant for somebody. And I will let you go. Bye.